All right, what's good, everybody? Stats here back <clears throat> for another episode of Fate Extella, the Umbral Star. And as you can see, we got the whole squad chilling there. That's what's up. Looks kind of dope, you know. If you if you looked at the first one, like I just felt like this needed to be added in there because I thought that was a cool little touch, you know. We're looking in the the boundaries of cyberspace, the never-ending world, and you know I just realized like how much worse my memory is. Like if you see the caster on the side of Saber there, I mean it's just a silhouette, but like. She, I'm pretty sure she was in Fate Extra along with Elizabeth, and I just have, like, terrible memory, and this game might actually just be a sequel, in which case I probably should have replayed, like, through them, uh, before, like, while I was playing Unlimited Codes, because I got a terrible memory. I mean, like, the battle style was different, like, it was turn-based, but I might have played one of them in Japanese or something, but, like, that, that just uh, attributes to how bad my memory is, because I only remembered this saber, like, that, that's all I remembered. But this is good because I wanted to peep the gallery while we were at it. And we only have... I see 17 characters though. Can we play as all 17? Then again, some of your pictures are the same. Or, oh no, that's just the default Lancer thing. Okay. So they're not even like giving you a hint with like who it's supposed to be. So that's that's dope. Events. Those are just probably all the cutscenes. And there's a nice and whopping 255 and we don't even have... Bro, we didn't even have 11 of them. Oh, gosh. Bro, last episode was like 45 minutes. First one was 30 minutes. Like, that's crazy. I don't even know why I'm going in there. That's just asking for copyright. Encyclopedia? Background? No. Just the basic stuff. But, uh, Codecast. That's right. That's my skills and stuff. Uh, I'll need to look at that at some point. Like, these install skills. Normal attacks may deal poison. Increase power, increase power, normal attacks. Alright, there's, there's that stuff. Just wanted to take a quick little glance at that good stuff free battle side stories i don't know what i'll do for side stories i honestly m excuse me i honestly might keep the side stories for like the few times i get to stream on the weekends but it depends on how short they are because like if they're insanely short i don't want to just hop into the side story you know and then just have like a, a small little stream i would hope it'd, it'd be at least like a few hours or something but, uh, okay, so maybe we only have this many playable characters. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So there's 13 playable characters and not 17. So maybe the other ones are just exclusive to story. Because it, eh, no, I was going to say it'd be counting our characters. But you would think our characters would be unlocked plus our servants. That's, that's interesting. Hmm. I don't know if that counts like their costumes. But I definitely didn't get my Shackled Bride costume. And how did I find my first mission? Are we... We're definitely back in previous dialogue. So we were holding hands. Because we got to keep that consistent. Now, somebody did tell me what happens in the other one. Uh, like, if I would have picked the other option, which I love when people do that. Because, like, it, it's one of those things that kind of bugs me. Where it's like, I would go and look it back up. But at the same time, it's like, I, I wouldn't actually look it up. Because that's just too much work for, like, every single situation. And I can't remember when I play back through. But I was like, you know, she like she's she's like, ah, we'll ju we just got to stick with what we were doing. But I feel like the other one would have been better because he was talking about like, I guess technically I could have showed it off. But like, I feel like I got to stay true to what I said originally. But he was talking about like something about my confidence brimming or something. OK, maybe I just made that words up, made that what it, it doesn't matter. It's in the last thing. Read the comment. You know, they hit me with some knowledge like apparently Archer has no relation to the anime or something and his like history is different and his background's unknown all that type of stuff i don't know there's there's two different people that uh be hitting me with the facts and i appreciate it now the question is can i i wanted to know if i can actually see this is it just oh these are items oh it says craft item wow dude i thought when i got like a choker i could have put her in a choker oh i'm i'm so disappointed now i'm actually extremely disappointed What's oh, new in the settings? So oh, those are the skills. He also said that I can change my name into a female at different times. And I, I, oh, I can. Oh, shit. Oh, that's fucking amazing. Like most, most games would not let you do that. You'd have to run through it again. So you can literally switch through and then see, oh, that's amazing. I fucking love that. This game is great. This game is great. So let's go ahead, hop into it. Hopefully we don't have as much dialogue now. We can get some action for you guys because 
there has been a nice chunk of talking. But I'm, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it so far. So, yes. The regalia may hold even more secrets yet to be discovered. Oh, and new content added the... Wait, what? Oh, wait. I'm just supposed to... No. I'm supposed to rest. Did I not have an exclamation mark there before? Hey, is that my girl, uh, Ryder? Is Ryder in this? Looks like Ryder. It looks like Ryder, but we're questioning the authority. Heading into chapter two. Oh, I didn't even realize the loading was done. Bro, I'm telling you, her titties were not that big before. <clears throat> they definitely look bigger. You scarcely need me to tell you this, but please do not overexert yourself. I don't know why she calls me Praetor every time. Like, I, I just, I don't like, call me by my name, all right? I understand it's like supposed to be like a king or some, some with thrones and kings like from the way back, but like, bruh. I have a name for a reason. You better drop that name that you had me put into the game. How are you going to have me put in a name and then not even use it? You feel me? From the look on your face, you are not yet at your finest. Uh, better off than before, perhaps, but still in need of rest. Hmm. Now, how can I help you relax? Oh, you know what you can do. Ah, lemons covered in sugar. So sweet and stimulating, bro. When I think of lemons or like oranges or something, because you know how when you juice those things, you put it on like that little tip and twist it. I always just think of like putting it on nipples and twisting it. Oh, okay. And then some sugar, bro. Ooh, some lemon coated tits, like with sugar, and then the sugar would stick to the lemon. Okay, I gotta stop. Saber laughs in ecstasy as she cares for me. Her words and her smile I'll ease my worries. And the paid fades. Paid fades. The pain fades almost completely. Wait, you're still in a bit of pain, aren't you? Hmm. I would have thought that the pain would ease by now, but I won't compound your suffering by asking too many questions. As always, I appreciate your candor. The trust between us is paramount, after all. Thank you, Saber, but it's not what you think. I'm fine for now, so I think we should get back to work. We need to know what happened to Seraph at the, after the end of the Holy Grail War and why Caster has a copy of me. Hmm, we'll have to move quickly. I'd caution against being hasty, but that look in your eye tells me I shouldn't bother. Once your purpose takes hold, nothing can dissuade you. Come, we can access the Moon Cell Core remotely from the throne. Uh, now that I think about it, we have have we confirmed Caster's claim about taking our territory? We haven't yet, have we? Since we went straight to my room when we got back, anyways, it's settled off to the throne room now. Let's go. Back to the throne. Put the cr Oh, look at those roses. I mean, I guess it's fitting. Oh, wow. She's actually sitting in her throne. What the hell? I thought this was for me, bro. I mean, I know it's hers and, like, the chair, the throne, and the roses. and But come on, man. With this throne, my throne, I can use the regalia to survey all corners of Seraph. Oh, shit. Never mind. She's setting up, she's setting up that high techness. Oh, Sacaster so spoke the truth between her conquests and the land, old lands and the new ones she has taken half already. Am I gonna hear her? What the fuck? <laughs> Bro, first of all, it took her forever to say that sentence, but like, well, what the? Get in here right now, not, not right now. Anyway, let us try accessing the Moon Cell Core as well. Perhaps it can tell us more of the second Regali and the other Praetor. Boop. Oh, shit. Bro, it looks hilarious with, like, her hands. Like, what if she had no hands and she just had those, like, frilly things sticking out? That would be, a. Uh... Oh, shit. Lockdown. Lockdown. Error. Nani? Access denied. Why? That can't be. I have the Moon Cell's royal authority. They can't force me to start over now. Not while the regalia still shines upon my finger. Oh, shit. Who is this? Oh, this is the spiky. Yo, I was just going to say, who was that nigga on the left? And it's that spiky haired dude. So is he a servant? Of course, it still shines. You prove your right to bear it at the end of the moon's Holy Grail War. And that is why servant Saber, you remain the sovereign of Seraph. But Seraph now suffers from a fatal error. How dare you barge through our doors unannounced, state your name, and then bam. Oh. Oh. What do I feel like I saw this dude? Maybe I saw him in the book, the art book, strategy. You know, this game actually came with a guide. It's like the first guide I've seen in like five, six, seven years. Dude, games don't come with guides anymore. And if they do, it's like digital. But uh, as you can see, I am a caster class servant. Not what I was expecting. I was expecting some black hair. Even when I saw like, what? Why did I, th Why did I think his hair was a black? Uh, well, I suppose that's not enough information very well. Allow me to prove my loyalty to you. Accept my true name. Oh, snap. Okay. Except my true name is a token of fealty. I am Archimedes. I am a system update worker chosen by Seraph. System update? What? She, she doesn't know what a system update is. What? 
Bro, she didn't even try to say it, right? What? Okay. I didn't expect it would take this long to reach you. That was my miscalculation. Normally with my admin access, I can teleport anywhere, but now I have to walk. Um... But that's my problem, not yours. A pleasure, your majesty, and you, Lord Tachinchi. Good to see you again. What? How does he know my name? Wait a minute. Oh, wait, hold a minute. Archimedes, Archimedes, are you that Archimedes? I am, so you know me then. Well, well, what a small world we live in. Of course, I know you all in Rome have heard of the Greek genius. I have even had the pleasure of studying your works a bit myself. Bro, I love her little smug face. I, I'm literally like... It's like, ah, dude, you just can't, like, I don't know if it's the red or the, it's something about that face. Are her eyes a different color? Is this Saber's eyes a different color? Yo, eye color makes a big difference. People sleep on that. It, it makes a very big difference. But her emotions are, are just so cute. And she got the titties in this game. Like, you, what? What doesn't she have? She's fine as fuck. And then she's got a slim body under that dress. I mean, he's still slim, but, like, you know, it's, it's always not as slim as you slimming when you gymming. Though I've heard it said, you were too smart for your own good, and perhaps too far ahead of your time. Still, you seem a fine young man. Regardless, you spoke just now as if you knew the Praetor personally. I do indeed. I spent many hours with Lord Dojinchi in the Moon Cell Corps. Hmm, is that so? Then why is he so confused to see you adorably confused at that? I could stare at that face all day. Nigga, my dude has no expression! He never has expression, but no. Not right now. Okay, see, like that? Eh, I don't know. You strolled straight into our throne room. Clearly, you're no ordinary man. You claim to be harmless enough, but how do we know? I mean, he gave us our name, you know? Well, what kind of enemy would give you their name? Actually, a lot of people would, you know? It'd be like, oh, my knight's code, you know? But, uh, I apologize for my rudeness. I shouldn't have barged in, but harmless or not, I have no intention of making enemies here. If I may be so presumptuous, your majesty, I've come here to offer you my help. Hmm, then you have my hospitality. Revealing your identity is no small thing. Consider yourself beyond suspicion for now. All formalities aside, then, what do you think we should do? I nod to Saber as I think of an answer. System update, fatal error, so many questions. Okay. Hmm. I want to know about this. What happened was part of an assault from the enemy. What enemy? Unknown being attacked, the Lord, at the Moon Cell Corps, during the registration of the Royal Authority, and there was no shame in losing it. Whatever it was, it was large and powerful. Was an enemy programmer or servant's noble phantasm? We don't know that either, but it seemed like um, it seemed almost like a titan from before the age of the gods. Oh shit! That thing was that big, bro. That definitely looked like a normal sized person. If that's what we were talking to at the start, and he was with us, but then again, I do remember him being with us. We just didn't know who he was. An image floats in the back of my mind, just a fragment, hard to make out, but I do remember that giant hand reaching out for me, and a voice like an echo inside a deep cavern. The words it spoke, it called itself a solo servant. Is that true? Luckily, it seems he has recovered. Bro, my nose, like, it's it's like stuffed, but not stuffed. I don't know if it's allergies, or because I just woke up cold as shit. But I like, as I talk, it like, it, it'll slowly like plug up. And it's like, what the fuck? So if I'm, if I'm sniffly and stuff, I apologize, but you know, I gotta get this recording done, because, you know, I gotta keep the content flowing. I'm still feeling good. I'm feeling good. You know, they just got a lot of dialogue, and then, uh, gotta get some stuff recorded for, uh, before I head to PAX out. So if any of you are grown, feel free to say hello. But luckily, oh wait, I said he recovered. But I believe that attacks will cause this schism <laughs> we're seeing right now. That attack in other worlds to divided regalia. Divided? Ooh. I, I'd almost forgotten. Yes, I think I'm starting to understand the reason why there are two regalia and why. Oh, it is that one was split and stolen. Yes, just as you surmised, the enemy sundered the regalia itself and made off with the other half. And then after the royal registration, the pair came back with our piece. And that the other piece went to that caster, that damned fox usurped it right out from under us. Is that right? Then she was the enemy at the moon cell cord. That trickster must have changed her appearance, disguised herself as that titan. Hmm. I don't think so. Wow. I really got to go through all these options? <clears throat> or I picked the wrong one. Tell me more about you. I don't care about no fatal error, bro. Ah, yeah, like, it's, it's that serious. If there's an error, then it's an error. Like, what are you, what are you supposed to do? <clears throat> ah, yes. Let me explain myself. As you know, my true name is Archimedes. I was summoned and given the caster class. Although I am a servant, I am fortunately like a master of my own. Unlike yourself, your majesty. So you are a wanderer? Ah, no. I never had a master to begin with. The moon cell... 
It self-summoned me to manage Seraph. Some would call me a solo servant. Oh, you a solo servant too, huh? Questionable. Very questionable. My job is to keep the moon cell system up to date. It needed a reliable engineer and it chose me. Hmm. Okay, we literally. Holy as it might be, the grail is still a system and it needs a regular maintenance. Its normal update occurs every 14,000 years. I need to make sure that for the next 14,000 year mark, the system will manage itself on its own without any issues. Your victory in the war altered Seraph's management such that the moon cells system updated as scheduled on one side. Originally, both sides were meant to proceed at the same time, but I presume that didn't quite go as planned. Correct. You see, the Regalia truly is the royal authority of the moon cell, and that it represents the unity of the moon cell and Seraph. In fact, the system is so tightly bound to the Regalia that the update cannot properly proceed without it. In other words, I now require your permission to use it as part of my duty. Hmm. Hammer. Incidentally, had the update proceeded as scheduled, those hostile programs you've been seeing would never have spawned. Hmm, is that so? Whatever it was, it was extraordinarily powerful, so much that I could do nothing to stop it. You barely survived. In fact, let me put it plainly, I had to resuscitate you. It took all of my effort to pour you from the core intact. The Greek genius indeed, one of the greatest scholars in human history, I must say. Please allow you to show me Please allow me to show you my gratitude. You have done us a commendable service. What happened to the regalia was unfortunate, but your rescue of the Praetor was a righteous deed, befitting of a no noble scholar. Uh please do not waste such praises on me, Lord Nero. You were the righteous king of Seraph, and as Seraph's chief maintenance man, assisting your master and companion is no more than my duty. Besides, it was the right thing to do, ethically and mathematically. I serve an orderly kingdom, after all, so please think of me as a mere student, ready to do what needs to be done. Your words are sound, and you call me righteous king? Would you also say that certain other kings are unrighteous? Yes, exactly. The one who bears the other regalia is a mere pretender. Caster Servant's true name is Tamamo no Mai. Just as I thought, I had hoped against all odds that she was someone else in disguise, but it is indeed her, Sai. Uh, I feel like I've heard that name somewhere before. The name has a pull for me, a deeper meaning. Do we fight together once in the war, but something doesn't add up? If we fought side by side, why can't I remember anything else about her? Are you aware your majesty is suffering from amnesia, another side effect uh, of the regalia sundering, no doubt? How come this dude uses my name, but she doesn't? Do we guess is that supposed to be like my little pet name for her? Is that just like she she doesn't even dare utter my word because I mean so much to her? Utter my word, utter my name. I get him for the rest, but please elaborate, noble scholar. I'd rather hear from you, as your Majesty wishes. Simply put, half of my memory has been stolen. Well, half of like I said, half of my memory, but like it's it's half of you know the Lord's Majesty. But like the Lord's Majesty, what? Okay, look, this is too much reading for me. I'm just trying to fucking cut some shit up, bro. Wait, hold on. Half? You mean half of me is gone? Hey, shit, they stole the other half. That's where my other memories are. I have a personal skill called method elucidation that allows me to discern such things. In other words, at present, your majesty exists only as a mind implanted in an artificial form. Wait, you telling me that nigga has my real body? Well, technically, isn't that the whole situation for everyone if we're, like, in a virtual world, but... I exist only as a what? No, but as a wizard, my soul and mind have already been uploaded to the moon. See, that? that's what I'm saying. There's nothing unusual about that now. In my experience, to implant an artificial body requires an individual's personality and passions, his or her mind in other words, but that alone is what resides within your digital shell now. Are you saying that he's missing something? I am. Your majesty is still a person, of course, but now lacks something critical. The mind is obviously critical in itself. But it constitutes only a small percentage of the whole self. Passion, experience, memory, the mind can hold them and manage them, but it cannot keep them forever. To persist beyond the transience uh, of mortal life, they require a soul. As you say, continue scholar without a soul, such things fade away in time. Fade away? Oh no! Then what she had, that duplicate was, yes, separated along with the Gralia was the other half of him, most likely the soul. But she stole my fucking soul? That's crazy. You could fuck that hollow king. I'm fucking his soul, baby. Damn, what if you got soul fucked? That's crazy. She's over there soul fucking me? I'm missing out on that. But technically, if I come back together, that means I got both. That's, that kind of sounds like a win situation for me. It's starting to make sense. My memory loss, my physical condition, both for the same reason. Nothing else I understand this much. I don't want to die. For the sake of the Seraph and for my own soul, we have to repair the Regalia and do something about that caster. No matter what, besides their saber to consider. I don't want to see her with that sad look. Uh-huh. Still, you smile through it all even when you're staring down oblivion. 
It's okay, this won't be hard at all. I'm here, she's here, and it's obvious what we have to do. Reclaim all of Sarah for Store the Regalia. How hard could that be? My skills, limited as they may be, are at all at the disposal. I kind of want to play with them. I I'm curious as like how the casters are going to play. Because they should be ranged, I would assume. Unless it's like close combat, just manifestations. Then again, that left arm looks kind of wild. With your blood, why is that a fist and then the other one's just dangling? I don't know. With your blessing and the completed regalia, we shall restore the system and make it all it should be. Hmm. Then I name you my strategist. And... On to the next part. Oh no, we are... We are at the room. And this is... Okay, well, there's... What, what do we have to talk about? Half my territories have been taken, my beloved predator has been split in two and only at one remains. Damn that crafty little fox declaring war against me. No need to worry, if she can take our land, we can take it back. She might think she owns her half, but we'll show her how wrong she really is. Of course, crafty as she is, she's no doubt plotting further treachery as we speak. But I see she hasn't shaken you. I see that gentle fire in your eyes, the warmth that always kindles my soul time and time again. She's not going to shake me. I know Saber's the right person to wear the regalia, and I know Saber's gonna win. Caster doesn't stand a chance against her. Not a chance, you say? Are you truly so confident in me? Do you believe so deeply in my right to rule, then? It is your faith that makes me that makes you smile so? Very well, I do. I do, of course, suggest that you rest for now, but I meanwhile shall continue to justify your faith in me. As the fifth emperor of the Roman Empire, and as the moon cell's chosen victor, I am the one and only sovereign of Serov. So declare, Nero Claudius! You and I will seize back what was taken and unite the land. My true campaign begins now. Her, uh, 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 her words echoed throughout the room, her declaration, her real name, an ally I could never forget. We fought together, we survived together, and through it all, we held each other. The Emperor of Roses, Nero Claudius, uh, centuries ago, the citizens of ancient Rome showered her with praise and applause, and here we are fighting together again. Nothing can come between us, no matter who we're up against, even if it's me, all I care about is being with her. Honestly, that's all that's keeping me moving. And now we can rest. Oh shit, never mind. That says battle. Oh shit. Oh, so if we're not in the room, my room stage select. On the stage select screen, you can choose a battlefield to fight on. When you select play battle stage, you will immediately go straight into battle. When you select play the whole chapter, you will be able to look back on the events that happened. Okay, so that that's pretty nice. Because see, this is what I was wondering. I was like, if they let you choose, like if you're able... To pick your like switch between genders and stuff i was like unless you have like a new game plus or something it wouldn't matter it's like it either just picks up where you are in the story and changes there but this actually lets you like relive the whole thing so that that actually works out pretty nice so i might you know uh, you know I can, I can play through and just like still be on the same save i actually really like the way that is so you can just choose the stage if you wanted to like say i wanted a higher rank or, you know, play the chapter again as a female and see the dialogue. Because apparently we still got this little Yuri situation going on if we're a female. So, I, I could dig it. Um, but uh, let's go ahead and hop into stage two then. I think the game is finally picking up. What if there were only five stages? Okay, this uh, that would only be four. Let's stop. Uh, okay, recommended level four. We are level four. Let's hop into it. Bam, boom, kabing, kabang, kabap, boop, bop, ba, dang. <clears throat> Alright, if anybody else is on this stage, I want to see if I can switch to them. These dudes got some big axes. You got a big ass axe! Alright, can you... Bro, why does he sound like he's talking through a walkie-talkie? Can you hear me, your majesty? It's time to release the Regalia's hidden power. It has a hidden power? I knew it. Indeed, by its royal authority, you can draw mana from the moon cell. Directly from the moon cell. So even the moon cell itself provides tribute to its ruler, then. Uh, both of you need to pour your own mana into it first. Understood. I'm counting on you. Oh shit. Are we about to get a new move? Or does that mean I can use skills? Uh, pouring mana into the regalia since I'm fused with the ring, I can easily visualize how to do that. I wrap around Saber's finger and move close to her. Uh, 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 I try to imagine the past of the intertwined circuits. The ring connected to Saber myself. I lay my breathing over hers and I lay my mana over hers. And... Oh shit, is this the transformation? Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh, she's naked. Oh shit, what is this? Oh shit, the titties. Oh fuck, this outfit's clean as hell. Oh shit. Bro? Oh, this is fucking raw. 
This is raw as shit. Bro, we're fucking... F oh, this is dope as shit. Let's fucking go. Holy shit, bro. This is raw. This is so fucking raw. Yo, can I hit that circle thing? Install skill? Wait. Is it, is it saying I just picked up a bunch of them? It might just be saying that. I was like, fuck, am I missing something? Nah, let's go. Okay. Yeah, this fucking soundtrack is gorgeous. Hold up, let me see these. Let me, let me like, peep these combos. Okay, so you got the, you got the triangle in the air. You got your basic triangle. Get blown back. You got your... Oh, fuck, it ran out! No! Oh, God. <laughs> Bruh. So what happens when you finish up at the... Ah, oh, it is! What's up, Medusa? Medusa, hold on. Uh, well, fuck. What, what, what is it? I don't even know what it is. Medusa... Ulamgara, Dulang, Dulang, Batungalang, Gundung, Ulamdaga. Only when I record would I forget the bra. Fuck. I have. I feel like there's some type of like memory loss recording syndrome, where you just forget everything. Dulamgara. What the fuck is it, man? It's not. God, that's bugging me. <laughs> I've been waiting. You have no chance of winning. Oh shit. Oh shit. There's an eyeball in the sky. Eye in the sky. This place is already under my eye. Locked in blood. Fort Andromeda. Andromeda. The fuck? Don't ask me, man. Don't ask me. Let me get them goodies. Boop. I want some sake. Um. Alright, which sector are we headed to? Oh, fuck. I didn't want to go to three. I wanted to go to one. Ah, oh, we're taking the... Holy shit, we're flying. Dude, I just want to fucking go into that form again. That was raw as shit. Oh, okay. Can we really not go there? Oh, can I sprint? On the battle screen, a battle objective will be displayed instead of fighting in the dark. As long as you can send it, you... The... The... What? Uh, sectors or enemy servants that correspond to battle objectives will be marked with green. Bro, there was a way to sprint. What the fuck? They just used an... I, I just used a fucking heart to heal me. What? Oh, fuck. I hit the wrong one. Shit! Okay, so I can't switch, though. That's dope. Preparations to invade. <laughs> I just fucking healed myself. Dad, I wasted an item. Restart the LP! When plants or enemy servants prepare to invade other sectors, an arrow will appear on the mini-map. Does that mean I can switch to every fucking person we have? Hold on. Wait, what? The, why the fuck did he... Okay, so... The, so how come Lancer and... So, like, why this dude is here, so I can't switch between them. And I can't switch between Lancer... Dude, there was a way to air dash, and I'm, I'm scared to press buttons now. Fuck. Wait, I can't switch. No, I can I can infinitely switch. Alright, let's see. Yo, can I switch mid-combo? Oh, so it waits. Alright, let's see what Archer's got. Okay, so triangle's his bow. What about up here? What the fuck is that? Hold on. Hold on. Oh, shit. Hold on, hold on. Wait, what? Why did I dip back like that? What? What was that? I know y'all saw that, like, that slow-mo-ass dodge. Oh, that's fucking raw. Yup, he got some heat. No good, the enemy. Wait, what? Near defeat crisis danger mode? Bro, we're already getting fucking dangered on? Oh shit. Bro, how do I dash? What the fuck? I just missed that shit. I didn't even mean to do that. I forgot how to dash. Is this the danger zone? What the fuck's the danger zone? Oh, no, I'm hella confused already. Dude, they all look like they're in fucking danger. Alright, here we go. Yo, nobody told me about this shit, though. Am I just supposed to hit it when the little things fill up? That seems about right. That actually looks right. Yo, does that mean this dude has a moon mode, too? Let me see your fucking transformation. What would his transformation be, though? Oh, shit. Did we take over this sector? No. Where the fuck is his last aggressor? Hello? What? This one looks friendly. I'm so lost. Holy shit, they're about to claim a bunch of fucking keys. What's this bottom left one? Oh gosh, we're gonna fucking fail. We're gonna fucking fail. We need help. Back up. SOS. Bam, gone. I don't even know what the requirement is. Like if I have a certain, my little gauge all down there where it says ready. I'm assuming these little bars. Wow, I thought that was healing me, and that fills up my thing, so I'm assuming that's how many, like, hits I can do in that combo for that shit. 
Yo, does that stay afterwards? Am I? There he is. God, I was like, where the fuck is this dude? Yeah. So that's the amount of things I can use in this mode. So it's definitely when they pop up. All right, so that that's understood there. Um, gone, please. This whole fucking world's in danger. Did he not die? Oh my gosh, why the fuck would you get blown down here? Bro, you gotta go. Get out. Alright. Later. You guys stay here. There should be no reason. I was about to say, there should be no reason to fight you guys. I'm about to say, we took over this. Bro, what the fuck is Dash? I need to know this. There we go. Okay. Is there not a faster sprint, though? Is dashing the fastest I, like fastest means of transfer transformation? Transportation that I have? I need to get the little... uh key cores too oh nice there you go there you go boy bro I love that like aftershock that he has all right we got the basic square combo oh shit never mind that wasn't even done yeah he's fucking raw I mean was it was he really expected to not be raw though fucking hit this thing I always hit this thing with this it takes it out the fastest at least to me it does I ain't trying to have him like spread no babies to the world so we'll go ahead and mop that uh yeet Yo, I just realized that sword that he's using. What fucking sword is that? That looks a lot like Excalibur. I don't recall this dude ever having the ability to use Excalibur. But at the same time, my nigga's got uh, thousands of swords. Got an arsenal like Gilgamesh, so. You know, he could. My gosh, blind me a little more, why don't you? Alright, you guys should all be clean. Let me pick up my little drink here. Okay. Got my dashes. What if dashes use stamina? What the fuck? I can't go this way. Am I tripping? To the right. To the right, to the left. Isn't this where we came? I swear that was where we came in. What? This is where we came in. Are you telling me that there was another way I could have went? Oh, that's a heal. Alright, we're chilling. We're heading over here. Let me get off. <laughs> Bruh. Wait. I just realized you could bunch them up like that. And then just hit them with the... A whop! Gone. Bam. 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 And... Bro, is that not Excalibur? That's definitely fucking Excalibur. If that's not Excalibur, please tell me what the fuck that is. Because I am... I am almost positive that that shit's Excalibur. Got him. Got him. Oh, he's down. He's down, boys. Let it. Let, hey, hey, hey. Chill. Let it rain on him. Hey, I was just about to say I should, uh. I should switch to my girl because she's probably got higher levels on him. But, uh. He's kind of raw. I mean, all of them are going to have limited skills until I get to a certain point. But let's go ahead and drop it back on her. I don't know if she's the only one that can transform. I don't know if that, that gauge, the little orange gauge, though, if that's my transformation gauge. I might. Nope. Where the, where's my gauge for transforming hidden? We have one piece for the special. The blue things are for the... The whatever this shit's called right here. And then... I'm assuming the green is my health. Might just need a peep at that, uh... The guy actually tells you a bunch of shit. But, like, at the same time... I figured they would've just told me the shit that I needed to know in the tutorial. Sometimes games we don't be telling you shit. You would think they would. You either got a tutorial that tells you too much and takes fucking forever, or you have a tutorial that doesn't tell you shit. There's no just in-between. They don't want to just give me the details about what what is. I actually read my little my little starting map things. She's, she's still so raw. See, why is my gauge... Oh, my gauge wasn't flashing before, though. Wait, can he transform? I want to see if he can transform. What the fuck is that? Oh, shit, he can. Let's go. Woo! We got some big ass blades now, boy. I thought he was about to have like a fancy ass transformation, though. Fuck! And everybody just died. That was a terrible time to use it. I should have saved it for the boss, to be honest. Bro, the music changes too. That's lit. Hold on, I gotta get this. I think this is a key piece. Yep. I can see a special too. Okay, so I can. How come he didn't have a transformation though? Bro, that's dope as fuck. Look at these big ass blades. Combat, for the most part, is the same, though. That's kind of disappointing. Like, she actually... Tra Maybe because he he doesn't change like she does. Uh, Sector 1? Uh, sector 1 is right above me. Isn't that where I just came from? Oh, no. Sector... I'm looking at the keys. 
Where the fuck is Sector 1? Oh, Sector 1's up there in the top. No, that's the keys as well. What the fuck? Is this Sector 1? Am I, am I stupid? I might just be stupid. All these fucking ones on the map are confusing the fuck out of me. Alright, well, I know how to use this now. Dude, where, where, where's the actual fucking Sector 1? None of these hoes have names on them? Alright, well, not, let me go back to her. Because I was just using her for the time being for, uh... Well, because she's a higher level. Can't believe I used the fucking potion. Should have looked at the things. Dude was like, use the D-pad. Now, I wondered why I, like, didn't attempt to use it, but I thought they were all items, so I didn't use it. But then this one's infinite up there. So I should have known. This shows, like, a, a little switch-looking thing. Oh, wait! Is that a new combo? Hold up, hold up. That was a new combo. Ah, uh, oh, no, wait. That was the shield one. I could have sworn we just went in, like, a spinning vortex move. Did we not? Am I tripping? I might just be tripping. Get him. Gotta get the aggressors. Bam. 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 And... Gone. So, if Lancer's still here, though... Along with Caster... Where is... Whatever we were missing. Where's the last key piece for specials? I want to see archers. Uh, we got our little bento box to heal. Oh, Sector 1 has to be that big ass dude up top. Do you see that giant ass like face? Oh shit, we are losing so many spots too. We're in danger. Oh, see there. There it was. That is a new move. Fuck, I need to use like a thing because we are dying. We are in danger. Um, where's the aggressor? Please kill them. We don't have that many hits, but I would hope that finishes them. Is that the last one, or is that the other? Uh, where's the last one? I just realized there's a little waypoint thing pointing me to him right there. This whole time. What did he just say? I missed it. Lancer! Lancer! Bro, I'm fucking down here and this dude's stuck up here. You either fall down- Oh my gosh, how can I slide off but he can't? I can't see what the fuck is going on right now with all this slashing in my face. Alright, is he dead? There we go. Alright, we gotta head up there. Is there an item thing that I missed for a special? You see it? See it? See it? I would say you can see it on the map, but... Favorable turn and turn for the worse. Along with battle objectives, if you perform an effective action, a favorable turn. Uh, okay. If I'm put in a disadvantageous situation, turn for the worse, you may be pushed to defeat. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, we gotta go up there. Uh, I'm assuming, I don't know if that's Sector 6. I'm assuming that's Sector 6. That has a 6 on it, like. Can't see shit for anything else, though. So how the fuck would I even know? Oh shit, I can like, I can, I can super boost the fuck out of it though. Did we not take over this sector? How many aggressors are here? I'm seeing if I miss like an item for a special because I want to see archers. Got the aggressor. Boop, boop. I like how they're yellow in this and I don't know if that's like their true color or if... Like, I feel like that would, because they stand out, but they look the same when they're in, like, here with everybody else. They're just a little bigger. I guess purple, too. Because the other ones are blue. Acha! <laughs> Gone. I love that move right there. And the, I just love that the, like, blast has a trail. Like, it just sits there. That's beautiful. Alright, do I see an item? Like, at the same time, I always feel rushed, but then at the same time, like, I don't want to just miss some, like, easy shit. That's backwards. I don't know what is going on down there. And I see arrows directing me like I need to go to Sector 1 or something. I feel like that special key is down there in the bottom left corner where the 6 is. Because I see, like, an orange piece somewhere. Uh... I think we almost have our transformation back. Didn't we just take this like two seconds ago? All these rooftops look the same. How the fuck am I supposed to know which territory is different? 
Where's, uh... Where are the aggressors? Where's my waypoint thing? Wait, is there not actually a waypoint? Is it just these enemies? Oh, they're, they're not back yet. How... How does one lose a territory to enemies that don't exist? Well, that just... That makes no sense to me. They gotta be here somewhere. Oh, now they sp That's... What the fuck? Alright. Saber. I better see this transformation. There we go. Yeah, okay. So, I don't know if it's like one of the... I don't want to say playable characters, but maybe only Saber and like... Caster, like the Fox Caster and stuff. I I don't know. We got the fucking fist gauntlets though now. I want to see a special. I feel like a special would be different in uh this form though. Oh fucking oh! I just love that fucking kick, bro. She like does a little. I don't, I don't know what type of somersault flip shit you would call that, but it's raw as hell. Okay, see, this says I don't even have a special thing. Oh, shit. Wait. So, do I have unlimited use of... Oh, shit. I might just have unlimited use of, like, specials or whatever this skill is when I'm in here. Ah. I didn't realize my gauge got blocked. My mic was blocking it. Okay. Interesting. I'll have to, I'll have to check that out when I'm with Archer again. So, I wonder if I can change this, or if it's just Archer, or... Like, how does this pick? Like, what if I could change between all four, or all six? No, yeah, no, yeah, all six, what the fuck? I don't know if you could play as Archimedes, though. I feel like you would, though, because he's, he's in your squad. Then again, there were 17 characters. If he was one of them and you can't play as him... I guess, eh, I guess. I'm not sure. Oh, fuck. Whoops. Oh, wait, the circle... What the fuck is my circle, or my special ability, then? I feel like I'm supposed to hold something. It's not circle. Why did I think it was circle? Circle is to fucking blow all these dudes away. What the fuck? I don't play this game for a day and I forget all this shit? I wonder if I can, I don't have to, I probably don't have to hit those actually now that I think about it and I can save it and use it again, maybe. I'm not quite sure. But this plan needs to go. Oh, that's what that thing is on the map. I thought it was some, like, fucking enemy or something. Okay. Oh, he's in danger. We definitely need to get to sector six or whatever the fuck that is. Can this thing drop? Oh my gosh, switch. We need damage, and you are not providing the damage we need. I'll fucking hit it with the one-hit dash if I have to. Bam! Gone. <laughs> yeah! I actually forgot that these missions and, like, these types of games, some of them can take, like, a fucking hour. And, I mean, granted, it, it all depends on if you get whatever needs to be done, done. But at the same time, it, it could just be long as shit. Uh, you know? Some of them are just fucking long. I got a sub. I got a five dollar foot long. Bro, what is this? Uh, hmm. Oi, oi. No, now he seems excited. I don't, I don't know if he's struggling or, or not. Do we have almost every zone too? This is literally the last zone we don't have. And nope, now we have this zone. Alright, to six it is. Then again, though, taking over all of them. Oh. Never mind that I disappeared. This might not even have a boss. I want that fucking special gauge, though. Now there's action going on. It's, uh... Stage 1? Dude, I don't know what the fuck like, these stages are. That one has a 6 on it, though. And I'm hoping it has my last, uh... Yeah, this thing looks so different when it's not covered in red. It's beautiful. I feel like I'm in some futuresque Tokyo. Fucking ghost in the shell. Except then when I see all these, I feel like I'm on a fucking dock or a, a shipping shipping area. I don't, I don't, I, there's a name for it. I don't fucking know that name. Oh, gosh. Never mind. Okay. Chill out, Berserker. Um. Hmm. Alright, Lubu. 
I wanted to get my last special gauge. And I, I was it was it, have I not been to one? This am I really missing like a place like that? Is it up here? It's right here. Please be it. Yes, I knew it was here. All right, let's see this special. What the fuck? How do I activate my special? I literally might have to open up the controls real quick. Um, where the hell did he go? He might be a threat. Let me see if I hit circle first. Oh, well, we missed him. We fucking missed him. Okay, it's whoever gets hit that gets lit up yellow. It has nothing to do with the aggressors. Like, they light up. See, he faded at the end of that. Well, to, to be fair, I was kind of scared that if I hit him, I might kill him. Of course, he can't talk because he's a... Whoa, what the fuck? Whoa! What the fuck? I just wanted to pause to see their rules, and now I can use command seals? Oh, shit. With all my command seals, I order you. Is that is that per stage, though? Or is that... Oh, fuck. This just changed the whole metagame. When you press options during a stage, you will access the command seal menu. You can use them. What the fuck? Yo, you it says you have three remaining. You could just drop them all at once. Okay, maybe that's not what I wanted. Maybe this is what I wanted. That's crazy. Do I have controls in here? Um, transform R2. Okay. Have I not pressed R2 this whole time? Excellent maneuver. Oh, that's the fucking dashing shit. Okay. Interesting. So, where is he? Ow, fuck off of me. Ow, fuck off of me. I'm just trying to see this shit. Okay. So, I haven't used this in my fucking form. Oh, shit. Let's go. The bone of my sword steals my body and fire. Blah, 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 blah. How the fuck do you say all this shit at the same time? Bruh, he's got to be speaking one and thinking the other. There's no way he drops all that shit at once, bruh. <laughs> I was like, I couldn't even keep up. I am the bone of my sword. My body is stealing my... Uh, or, uh, uh, my blood is fire, right? Yeah, my body is stealing, my blood is fire, and some other shit, and holy fuck. If that is not OP as shit... Okay. I was about to say, there's no way that fucker lived. Bro, I don't, I don't care who the fuck you are. That special is raw as fuck. Bro, what a fucking goat. Was he not even the... Oh, no, he might not have even been the boss. Regime matrix complete. Oh no, we can't go anywhere. That was it. It's just a planet. Uh, the first one. I thought maybe we still had to fight her. I was like, oh shit. Okay. Boop. The key of victory. Bam. Territory captured. Oh shit. Never mind. Oh fuck. She's still here. Oh shit! Oh, she looks raw as fuck! Ah, she's still sexy as hell, too. Oh my gosh. That's dope as hell, and they transported the squad here. Yo, that's fucking awesome. I thought we were done. We ain't done at all. Okay, then. Did I play this? I, I had a, something in mind for the thumbnail. And then I think I forgot already. Oh, because I wanted to use the transformation, but then a Medusa. Oh, this is about to be a, a fucking a multi multers thumbnail. I don't even know what the fuck. Like, there, there's just so much shit that just happened in this episode, especially because they take so long that it's like, it's like, what the fuck do I choose to cover? Which one is the most enticing? Why is she just blocking this shit, girl? Uh-uh. I'm lighting you up, baby. I light up your. Wait, why the fuck was she like, bro? Her she turns yellow, but her clothes stay the same. Excalibur! Ching! Okay, yeah, so if, if the fucking thing did get... Yeah, okay. See, you know... I was gonna say that there had to be... Okay, well, aside from the fact that my fucked up command... Is there some type of guard break? I was gonna say, because usually the way, like, a transformation like that works in Muso games... Is, like... If you, if you transform your fucking OP for that amount of time... Or you're fucking OP and then you use your special and then it instantly ends. But you have until like the last second. So that, that, it, yeah, I just, I guess I never hit fucking R2. 
Um, they don't ask me, alright? I don't fucking know. Actually, it's not necessarily the same in all... No, no. No, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's how it works in all of them. I'm almost positive that's how it works in all of them. Let's be honest, the last... The last game I played was probably Samurai Warriors 4? I think. Like the most recent ones, Samurai Warrior 4, Hyrule Warriors, that was hella long ago. Um, not even that long ago, because I, I had it, but I never like played it like that. Because I just fucking wait forever to play games. Shit, I don't know. Maybe I never had my Wii U hooked up. I, I, I don't use that for shit. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. I, I think, like, in terms of most recent, though, it'd still be Samurai Warriors. I understand they have Samurai Warriors 4 2. But, uh, it, it's. Eh, I don't think I decided that it was worth, like, copying that one. Because I think. I think that. You know how, like, sometimes they'll have, like, a second version of something, and it'll have, like, 10 more characters, but then that version has, like, no story mode and shit? Like, they always managed, like,. You would think it'd just be an expansion, but they always manage to fuck something up when they have things like that. Like, I think it has new characters, it probably has a new mode, but then it, it fucks up something else. I'm almost positive it has no story. Because, uh, I think Samurai Warriors 4 has a story and a fucking conquest mode. Where you have, like, your own created character and their own story on top of, like, taking over all the fucking places. Total Sectors 9. See, I should've, I should've got the other one. That was only 21 minutes? I find that very hard to believe. I don't, I don't even know what I'm talking about now. I swear, I just talk about random fucking shit, but we got a new triangle added. Install skills, all that good stuff. Alright. Uh, that, you know, that seems like a, a good point to stop as soon as I uh, hit back up the room. Hit the room back up, head back to the room. Shit, I guarantee we were talking longer than we were in that mission, though. By the way, it occurred to me from now, or for now, to refer to our enemies' holdings as Tamamo Domains. Uh, is that easy enough to understand? Communication and battle must be swift and clear. Ew. T land? What the fuck? This ain't Super Mario Land. Super Mario World. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, definitely not doing land. Stick with World of Tamamo. <sighs> the World of Tamamo is the first thing I think of. It's rather long, I suppose. Ah, but also rather brilliant. Wait, what the fuck did she say they were called, though? I'm pretty sure what she said was fine. Ah, uh, but we shouldn't call it that. It sounds too flattering. She is our enemy after all. Well, fucking land sounds stupid as hell too. You want to you want an enemy that's like, I live in fucking Wally Land. Now, uh, what if she did that? What if that's how you got fucked? You picked that option and it screws you. Damn, that would be crazy. Not only after a few tumbleweeds uh, left, return to my room and I can't fucking speak. Hey, Elizabeth. Tamamo domains. Oh, is that what she said? Yeah, well, what the fuck was wrong with- Okay, that was definitely better. Why did they give my character some stupid-ass suggestion? She said fucking Tamamo domains, and I get her with fucking world of Tamamo and Tamamo land. Is that what you call them? What a joke. All of Seraf belongs to me. Tamamo regalia? What are those appetizers? There's no need for wizards or servants anymore. All we need is for every sentient being in the world to bow to me. See, I'm... Oh, she's in a fucking sweater! Bro, she has so many fucking outfits, and she's fucking adorable in all of them. Although my dude said something about when she's older, she loses her horns. And I bring this up every time. But like, what is it? Uh, Toshi Den Densetsu? Toshi Densetsu? I think it's Toshi Densetsu, bro. It's a little fucking lowly girl. Succubus. Fucks the dude, and then she just ages over time. She's like fucking, you know, she fucking matures. Then she gets some titties and stuff. But he said she loses her dragon-like features and goes back to like, cause I think, I think what the, what the fuck she uh, is it actually is it actually Elizabeth that she's is that actually just the name that it is? No, it, it might just be Elizabeth. She was a fucking serial killer or something. I looked that shit up, which is which is kind of crazy, cause like you know they talk about like so and so is based after heroes and stuff, but like being based. Off of a fucking serial killer that bathes in their blood and shit? Like, that's just trippy. But he said as she gets older, she loses the fucking dragon horns and stuff, which kind of kills me. They got the anime with the dragon shit going on right now, too, and whoo! Fucking, ugh. Yeah. 
Seraphs, note this world's idle. Right, I just went all off on a tangent for a fucking minute just sitting there. See, this is why my LPs take even longer. It's you. Yep, it's me. Now pinker and more powerful than ever, but yeah. Oh, are those pa- Are those pan- Are those some pants? See some panties! I definitely see some fucking panties. That looks purple up here too, by the way. Like, from up there. Dark Ellie. No, make it Dark Eliza. Yes, call me that, you little piggy. And then apparently if I'm a female, I'm a baby squirrel. See, I remember these facts. Yo, what the fuck are up with her fingers? Is that like dragon fingers or, or nail polish? Yo, what do you think a dragon? I feel like a hand job from a dragon hand would not be comfortable. But then she got a soft palm. Soft palm, but then like rough fingers and scaly. But then what if they like lubed them up? What if they secreted like some type of liquid? I feel like that's some snake type shit. Does a snake like secrete anything? I don't think it secretes anything. I don't think a snake secretes anything like that. The fuck? Bruh, a snake girl would bite your dick and then you'd have some fucking venom in it. And then she'd suck it out. Bites your dick, puts venom in it, just to suck it out. That'd be crazy. But I, I feel like it'd be more like a... My venom is a... Uh, what is it? Aphrodisiac. Okay, what the fuck am I talking? I'm sorry. Uh, hmm. <laughs> What's with that face? You surprised? You scared? Yeah, I can smell your fear from here, bruh. She changes outfits every time on her own. That's fucking lit. I need this Shackled Bride DLC. And I don't think I fucking have it in my case. And I swear Amazon didn't send it to me. And I'm kind of sad because I want to be rocking that. I, Dark Eli, is the most beautiful princess ever to spawn from the depths. What? Dark Ellie, the most beautiful princess ever to spawn from the depths, have come to conquer Seraph. And yes, I go by Dark Eliza. I don't know why the fuck I called her Eli. Don't ask me. Maybe because Eliza, but it's Ellie. I don't, don't, I don't fucking know. Dark Eliza. Did, did, what? What? No. Okay, just let me fucking get over this. Well, it's simple. Like Tamamo Domain simple. But that servant, she has something in common with Saber, that's for sure. Uh, what? 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 Okay, so she goes by Dark Eliza. Her name is Elizabeth. And then she's gonna come over here and hit her with some Janglish? Like, is that what Japanese... What What the fuck is... No, it's English. She hit, him, she hit her with some English, but that's not... I mean, that's not... Eh, what, is that really English? Because she didn't, she didn't use no fucking English. That was just more like Jangish. Like fucking Japanese English. There's a difference, alright? Japs trying to speak English and English trying to speak Japanese. You feel me? They, even though they just call it English. But like, no, no, English is when Japanese people try to speak English. This is fucking Janglish, man. Alright? Don't fucking, just let me have this, alright? But like, they can't say L's. Because I said that in my fucking Senran Kagura video. So, Dark Elizabeth. That's not how she said it either. The fuck did she say? Elizabeth. Elizabeth? That doesn't say Elizabeth, but like, fuck. That's what she said, alright? Don't fucking, don't ask me! I, I see. This is all highly unfortunate. Why she got some janglish, bro? <laughs> Eliza. Oh, shit. She says Eliza. Bro, do I see some stomach above those panties? I'm about to zoom in time. Go, go, gadget, magnifying glass. Okay, stop. It would be fucking binoculars anyway. What the fuck, bro? And y'all wonder how I can talk over pictures for an hour? This is how. It's Doc Ellie or Doc Eliza. Dark Eliza. It's actually Eliza. Dude, that's fucking weird, Eliza. I'm saying Eliza. Fucking Thornberries is stuck in my system. Nah, it's Dark Ellie or Dark Eliza. What the hell name did you just call me? Is my perfect new costume throwing off your eyesight or something? Oh no, your costume is magnificent. Such melodic majesty. My arch rival who drives me to grow stronger with every class. You may have changed your appearance, but you are no doubt my strongest bandmate, Elizabeth. BAM! You see? I mean, I kind of fucked it up because I'm always faster than the Japs. You take too long to say your sentence, man. No offense, but like, speed it up. You know? But like, bam, she hit it. Elizabeth Batori. Uh, ah, uh. Why don't I get my panty shot from here? Yeah, that's right. Same as usual, Saber. Now then, rival. The Predator and I have business to attend to, so we must be off. But on that day when Seraph unites again, let us hold another concert and rise to even greater heights together. No, a collaboration concert? R really? You'd share your stage with me? Wait, no. That's not what I'm talking about at all. Not at all. Oh, she's so fucking innocent, man. She's like, oh, oh. I love him. Hmm? 
We're destined to clash forever. Now listen, Saber. I'll just tell you straight, bro. I want to see your fucking grown-up form. As your rival and a soon-to-be top idol of Seraph, I'm going to give you a first and final warning. Don't get in my way. And give me that regalia now or I'll tear your master's limbs off like big meaty caterpillars. And then my dude's just like, yeah, yeah, you ain't fucking doing that. <laughs> that will never happen. The regalia and the praetor belong to me. Heed my words and understand. But what? You're brushing off my whole monologue. Just gimme. Besides, it's weird for you to be the king. I ought to be a bigger king than you, but you're small. Hmm, and what you can- er, oh, and what about you is bigger than me? Ah, she fucking said it, boy! You shorter? You ain't got the titties? You ain't got the ass? But you got the bigger horns. You got the bigger horns, therefore you're hornier. Bam, got her. Hmm, and what about you is bigger than me? Nothing I can see. Do you follow me? Hmm, I'm not talking about that. And even if I were, I can make them bigger anytime I want. I lied! She's fucking- Oh, she's my type of girl! The conflictions. See, but I still, I don't, sorry, Dark Ellie, but you can't. I don't think I can get over Saber's little fucking facial expressions. They're just too cute. But then it's like, fuck, man. A girl that can shape shift into any form that you want. Like, that's why niggas love Mystique, bruh. When heroic spirits are first created, they're already given their ideal form. No matter how much you grow as a person, you will. You'll never grow that way? What the fuck? Wait, that's me saying that? Bruh, who told me she could transform it? I was just told otherwise. Yes, unless you are skilled at constructing new bodies, you're forever stuck in that one. But worry not, I find you adorable just as you are. I guess if she dies, though, and manifests back? Hmm, just don't get it. You're thinking too small, that's your problem. I won't be tied down to Seraph's rule, and I don't need to overthrow you to get what I want. I'll overthrow the moon cell itself, that's right, transform! Then I'll be the great king of terror, and reign like the god of the red planet. Great King of Terror? Why does that sound familiar? And Mars? Why did she specifically reference Mars? Yes, where have I heard that before? Somewhere in some minor culture, some minor culture's mythology, perhaps. Seriously, you don't know the Great King of Terror? I'm quoting a pretty famous prophet here. You ever heard of him? Well, I'm going to bring that prophecy to life, and I'll be a big new star. Dark Eli and Gomor? What the fuck? Dark Ellie and Gomor. It's fucking silent. Is that supposed to be French? Or something? What? She says Dark Ellie Ango Moy and then fucking Okay. Are you Millie? Mere are you not merely plagiarizing? Still the same Elizabeth. I'm telling you, she says Elizabeth! Still the same as always? Doc Elizabeth. <laughs> see hey, I see her little boobies. Hey, I kinda see him in the art too. You see the shading? They're kinda there. They're kind of there. Quit calling me that. I told you to cut that out. Oh, shit. She gonna transform? What? Why, why we have that close-up, bro? Look at them panties. Whatever. I'm done with this little sparring match. Remember, final warning. I'll never lose again. You'll never lock me up, and I don't need redemption. If evil's all I can be, that evil will bloom like a bloody flower. And I'll never hold back, no matter who I'm up against. Soldiers, bosses, chosen wielders of the regalia, whoever. Cross me again, and you'll regret it, Saber. <laughs> Lord Dojinshi. There goes a- WHAT?! Now she said fucking Elizabeth! Did she just say Elizabeth? Did I hear an L? You guys don't use fucking L's. What the fuck? Strange, she didn't seem her usual self. Regardless, we have realms to conquer. Let us return to my room and prepare. Interesting, interesting. And back in the room, baby. Look at them titties. New content has been added to the gallery. Mr. Code recipe has been added. But with that, we're going to go ahead and say goodnight. So I'm going to go ahead and hit this custom save. Because I don't be trusting that shit. Bam. Save. And we're out of there. Just like that. Bam. Saved. Anyways, we will be back with the next episode. But for now, this has been your boy Stats. And I'm out.